My name is Jay Nichols. I'm a marine biologist by training, and I kind of come to the awe project kind of through a side door. I've been thinking about um, the role of water in our cognitive, emotional, psychological, social, and spiritual well-being, um, sort of the neuropsychology of water, if you will. And uh, a big part of that turns out to be the experience of awe. And, um, and I, so I'll, I'll say a few words about that. But first, you know, Jeff, um, you brought up this, um, the subjective aspect of, of awe. And in, in our work with water, which intersects so completely with this whole conversation and all the videos, um, and I'll get into that uh, in a second, but we always start with the question, what's your water? And then pause with that. And when people, people may be confused by the question, they may need a little bit more, such as uh, the water you first fell in love with, the water you dream about. Let's talk about who took you there, who taught you about your water. Um, and it can be a, an incredibly positive memory. It can be a mixed emotional memory. But the point is, you start with that question because everybody's coming from a different place. And for someone, it might be, the vast Pacific Ocean, and for someone, it may be uh, a glass of water or a drop of water. Uh, it may be the water in their food. It may be the water in, in a creek.